for St. Francis House Calls TV. Ear infections are common among children and adults. Dr. Michael Noon explains the causes, symptoms, and treatment. If it's a middle ear infection, it's an infection with bacteria uh, within the middle ear space behind the eardrum. This will cause the eardrum to bulge, which can cause pain and actually can cause the eardrum to rupture. Because ear infections can result in permanent hearing loss and speech delays, it's important to be vigilant. Typically, high fevers, ear pain, and drainage from the ear will indicate an ear infection. Sometimes children, when they can't express that they're in pain, will pull on their ears to indicate that there's an infection. The specialists at Roper St. Francis can quickly treat ear infections and even help prevent them in the future. Ear infections usually are easily taken care of with antibiotics. The child will start to feel better in usually about 24 to 48 hours. The infection will typically resolve over the course of five to seven days. For children with recurrent titus media, the treatment ultimately is a tympanostomy tube, which allows the milliar space to ventilate. For more information, call 402 Care. And for more House Calls TV, visit us online at rsfh.com. I'm Angela May. Roper St. Francis House Calls TV.